members of that committee asked that Peter go away and organise for us a local investment uh, workshop. So Peter's just going to talk us through what, what, uh, what we've done about that. So a date has been set of the 18th of May. We've got uh, three external speakers attending. So we have legal and general coming who have experience of large regeneration projects. We have bridges coming who have experience of, of small scale um, so investments having a, a particular social aspect. And we also have um, our third speaker is CBRE, who's who again worked in both Sheffield and Manchester uh, in terms of regeneration projects. So we hope we're expecting them to deliver some effectively case studies on things that they've done. We're clearly keen to attract as many um, attendees from both from Murrow and from the other Merseyside authorities that would be appropriate. We're looking to uh, start at about half past ten for a couple of hours. Thank you, Chair. And uh, the importance of this is we've asked for this this presentation for this meeting, so uh, it's important that we uh, encourage those who are interested officers and members alike to attend. Uh, it is being extended to officers throughout Merseyside. So uh, just to let you know that, uh, that Peter's acted upon our request. It's happening, it will take place at the Cunard building. Okay, well I heard yeah. Um, so official invites will go out to that. Sorry, Brian. So yeah, have we not already been notified of this and then because that will be in the Cunard building
members of the Board of Directors, and members of the public, and further attendance. And there is a recommendation of the section 100A of the Local Government Act 1972. The public be excluded from the meeting during consideration of the following items of business on the grounds that they involve the likely disclosure of exact information as defined by the relevant paragraphs of our section of Schedule 12A as amended to that act of public interest test has been applied in favour of exclusion. So, uh, does anyone have to agree that? Yeah.